Hawkins here with Chicken Hawk Farm Set. Today we're going to check out a product from one of my favorite companies, or stores, I should say. Harbor Freight, as you know from the title. We're taking a look at this Harbor Freight, what do they call it? Multi Ultra Grip Flex Part Tray. Also known as these little silicone trays here. All right, now this was on sale a while, uh, I guess a few weeks ago, for 10 bucks. Not a bad deal because I think the normal price, if I remember right, is 20 the small one's 10 I think this one's 20 and the big one is 30 at Harbor Freight, normal prices. Uh, I haven't looked them up today, so they might have changed slightly. I'll post it right over here, the updated price to let you know. This is a silicone tray I picked up at Roll King. Uh, I guess it's been about a year or so ago, but it came in a three-pack. It had the small, medium, and large of these little silicone trays, and they had it on sale for 20 bucks. Uh, if you don't have a Roll King in your area, uh, or haven't heard of one, definitely look it up because sometimes they have amazing deals like that. So, 20 bucks. I got the small, medium, and large. Normal price, this would have been 20 bucks. So, I was like, well, maybe there's an issue. Maybe these aren't nearly as good as these. So, I picked one of these up to check it out. First biggest thing I noticed that I like better is this blue. The gray is very dull, and most of your tools are gray, so it does make it a little bit harder to see. Like if you have nut drivers in there or even screws and stuff, you know, because it does blend in. This one, on the other hand, everything sticks out and kind of pops. Uh, the other cool feature, if I had a little better lighting, see there, it does have rollers um, there, and it's got centimeters here. So for our Canadian friends like Tim the Toolman, he, you know, can use this and understand it, I guess, because it's got it speaks his language. But it does have their logo, U.S. General, in the center. But let's go to the, the what really matters. As far as the material, it feels exactly the same. I thought maybe this was going to be like super sticky. Put it across the table. Not a huge difference. I mean, you can see they're black and shiny. Not, you know, it's, it's about surface area of the grip, I'm assuming. Uh, is this a good one? Yes, this is good. It feels nice and firm. Uh, I do have this same one, in, you know, this size, but I couldn't find it right now. But like I said, Everything feels the same, other than the couple little features where, like I said, they have the customization there, and then the, they do have the little roller things there. That's cool. You know, are the pockets exactly the same on the bigger one? I don't exactly remember. I'm going to have to look it up, and uh, we'll get back to that at another point, or you can check that yourself. But, I mean, it's got the little cubby holes for your different tools and stuff. Are these worth buying? Yes. I do love them. I do use them a lot. I don't sit them on, I've seen videos where people set them on the fender of the car and it's like, oh, look, how cool this is. No. To me, that's just gimmicky and stuff. What it's nice for is when you're doing a project and you can go out and you can dump all your parts or your tools or whatever you need in this tray and set it in the ground. And it's not, you got a place on the grass with all your stuff. You can pick it up and take it with you. Uh, these little things, you know, if you've got sockets that are exact, exact size, yeah, sure. You know, stuff like that. Your little nut drivers, usually you already have a spot for them, but it does have that. Uh, so, you know, this does have the little, the, the same thing, it's a silicone mat. Uh, bonus tip, these are also silicone mats, so they're heat resistant. So, glue guns, soldering irons, things like that, heat guns, if you're using those things, put these down on your desk, it's going to help protect your desk. If that hot material or hot item like the soldering iron or whatever happens to fall or your heat gun, you go to set it down, you set it in here instead, it's not going to burn out of, you know, it's not going to burn your desk. It's, got, it's not going to melt this either. I gave some of these to my wife for uh, like her curling irons and straighteners and whatever. So, all right, but that's it. Are they worth it? At 10 bucks, I think this is totally worth it. At 20, I wouldn't do it. And not to mention, I already got these. I found this great deal. So keep a lookout for deals like that. Because I picked up like five boxes or four boxes. It was gifts for everybody. So. Alright, that's it for now. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And have a good one.